Hey guys, what's happening? I am really excited to show you this online microcontroller simulator that I just discovered. You may already know about it. Like I said, I just discovered, but it's called WalkWe. I'll put a link down below, but WOKWI.com, that's pretty easy to find, right? So here's why I think it's so exciting. You get to build stuff without blowing it up. Like, let's take a look here at something. These are examples from Arduino libraries. Oh, let's just do one here. MD Parole. This is a good one. So what we have here are LED matrix, the 8x8 LED matrices. And here we have our code on the left side. So we hit run the simulation. And I can just type down here. Hello, YouTube. And it comes out. Whatever changes you make over here on the program side, you're going to see over here. Now you're saying to yourself, well, where do you get all of this stuff? Well, I'll, I'll show you. But if you come over here to this diagram JSON, you can see here this is where the connections are. Okay. So let me just uh, we'll come back into this and do a freshie here. We'll say Arduino Uno. So here is a completely fresh one. Let's add a component. What do we want to do? Okay, how about we put in a potentiometer and our potentiometer will go ECC five volts brown. Ground and then our signal will run into analog zero. Then we're going to come up here and we'll grab it's one an LED. There we go, an LED. We'll stick our LED here like this. We'll make it an orange LED. I don't know why it's going to be an orange LED, but it is. And we're going to connect it to pin 3. I need a resistor. So what we've done here is we've simply laid out a system wherein we have our potentiometer that is going to send a variable voltage from 0 to 5 volts over here to our A0 pin. Then what we're going to do is we're going to take that <clears throat> and we're going to do a little map thing and uh, I'll show you in just a second. Okay. So here's the simple code I wrote. We create an integer called the pot for the potentiometer refers to this. In our setup, we're going to say pin mode analog zero is an input. Analog zero is our analog pin down here, which goes to the wiper on the pot. Then we have pin mode three is an output. That is this PWM pin right here, which as you can see goes to the LED. Then we have our LED going to the resistor. And you can see that reads 220 ohms. What I did was I went over here to diagram JSON and I just changed the value there. That's just the easy way to do it. So the first thing we're going to do is we are going to read that analog zero, store the value in the pot. 
Then we're going to create a new variable called PWM out by mapping the pots 0 to 1024 input to the PWM 20 to 255 output. And then we'll analog write pin 3 with that value. Oops. So now we can start the simulation. And as I adjust the potentiometer, you can see the brightness change. It's pretty cool. And as you can see here, there are tons upon tons of components that you can use. Anyway, I just ran across this the other day. I thought it was one of the coolest things I've seen if you're interested in uh, playing with Arduino. Oh, look at that. Even the reset button works. That's pretty cool. So there's a link to it down below. Check it out if this is something you're into. If not, you know, oh well. Now at least you know about it, right? All right, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. Feel free to comment, share, and don't forget to subscribe. Big thanks to all the patrons, and a big thanks to you for watching. That's it. I'm out. Peace.